In this exercise in Windows 10, I'd like to show you some quick ways to launch your programs. Some users believe that the best way is to fill your screen with icons. I prefer what you see here, which is a more simplistic approach. Uh, let me give you a couple of options. One is to click on the Windows icon in the lower left corner, or you can use the Windows key on most keyboards. It will pop up an alphabetized list of all your programs and then the start menu on the right. If I'm not sure if it's on the menu, all I need to do is instead of drag down this list and scroll through the entire thing, I can simply click on any letter of the alphabet since they're alphabetized. That will take me to the alphabet and any highlighted letter will be one that contains programs beginning with that name. I'm going to click on the letter R and click on my reader. And so that launched my PDF reader that's built into Windows 10. An even quicker way is to use the Cortina to ask me everything and I will start start typing the first two letters of the program. And in this case the first one was enough and it, it brought up the reader program and I'm one click away from starting it that way. Another option you have for often used programs is to put them in the taskbar. How do you do that? Well, let's do that with the reader program. I'll type in the letter R here. And instead of clicking on it with the left button, I will right click on it. I can pin it to the start menu, which I already have it, but I can pin it to the taskbar. So if I click on that, it loaded it on the taskbar off the recording screen. I'm going to drag the icon back on to the screen to whatever location I like and let go. And now if I use this program frequently, it's at the taskbar at the bottom of the screen. If I want to remove it from the taskbar at any point in time, I right click on it and do unpin from taskbar. I haven't actually removed the program. I've just taken it out of the taskbar. These are several ways that I have found useful to keep my screen clean and quickly launch programs that I use in Windows version 10. If you like this tutorial, please subscribe to our YouTube channel or check us out at sharperturtle.com. Thank you.